Okay, so if you didn't watch my last video, I was just talking about problems that future MacBooks may have, right? I mean, uh, problems that current MacBooks may have in the future. And I was talking about how I used an unsupported method. Like, oh, how to get Windows 11 on unsupported PCs. I did it, and then while, and then basically what I did was that, first of all, this just did not appear at all, right? What I actually had to do was that I literally had to go um, into computer management. I had to run it as administrator, and it was actually there, right? Whenever I'd plug my USB in, it wouldn't appear in the file explorer, but it would ap appear in the computer management. And it took me a, a long time, but it was actually simple. What you would have to do is that you would have to um, type in computer management and you and you and i would highly suggest running it as an administrator but i already fixed it you would have to click open give it a minute yeah give it a minute it takes a long time you know it's actually loading because there's a circle there And I'm charging my phone, so yeah. Oh, it sometimes doesn't want to open. Computer manager. Open. I hate to... Oh. I know I hate to be one of those guys who tells you how to do it, but then doesn't, you know, like, show you IRL, like, oh, you have a computer problem, this is how to fix it. If you need pictures or something, well, I'm not going to provide that. But I think it, since it's now opening, I'm. it's really easy. Just type in computer management here. When it appears, click run as administrator, and then if it asks, oh, do you give it permission, press yes, because it is made by Microsoft. And this only works if your USB is working. Basically, what would happen in my situation is that it wouldn't appear in Fire Ex in File Explorer, but it would appear in there. So then, what I had to do was that I had to find it in there, which was really easy, right? I would just go to what was it? No. Yep, right here. Okay. So basically, what you'd have to do is run it as manager, go to Disk Management. Wait for it to load. It's connecting a virtual di disk service. Okay, look right there. Do the main P. Want to know how I had to fix it? I had to click on it right. I had to. I had to right click it. And it wouldn't even give me the option to open it. Then I had to click change drive and letter paths. And then I had to click add and then it would give me an option right here to change the letter of it. And then I chose P and then I was like, no way that worked. And it appeared. So if you are trying to get on um, Mac OS, I mean, Windows 11, right? Well, first of all, wh what it is is that, that this, you have to use this specific version that's on the drive, that's on the drive. No other version will work unless you do the whole thing again. So what I did was that when it appeared, I went in there and then I copied it and then I put it in the download. See, right there, setups, I go, right? boom right there so if you do do it and it's ready to go before you even do anything go to the usb drive and copy that setup and copy it to your downloads or wherever just so then if the usb drive does go offline and you don't want to fix it well you have a spare copy you have to double click it like this Double click it and then click copy and then go wherever you need and, pr and just double click it again and press paste. Okay. I actually don't know when this video will be up, but yeah. So basically when it did that, it actually worked right. But then it got stuck on checking for updates.
What I did was that I closed it and tried to restart it, but this thing would not close. So then I just turned it off and back on. So I think that's what caused it. So if it, if this does happen and it's not closing and you want to restart it, well, make a copy of it first and then wait, right? And then once you have the copy somewhere else, right, in here, then try restarting it. And also we'll do that instruction and told you to make the drive appear good. That's what I did to fix it. But I read online and um um there is an easy way to fix it. Basically it it'll take seven to eight hours for this to be fixed. And if that doesn't work, um you have to delete some folders and follow a step. I'll link that in the description. So yeah, um all right, so yeah, there you go. Um that's how you fix it, right? um and if you and if you are wondering why this isn't why is this is the background it's because um i was trying to um uh, get right protection or white protection off of my nintendo 3ds um memory card right and then there was this guy saying, no, you just need to put this image i don't remember but i inserted this image in here and it was just one of the steps right and I just chose a random one, and this is the one I chose. But if this does happen, I'll just go here. And then go to this PC. Now go to desktop. Wait, no, 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 no. Go to this PC. And then find your drive. And then see how much is free. I have 94 gigabytes of... 94 gigabytes free of 281 which means i have 94 gigabytes free right um mac or um i mean windows 11 requires 64 so if there isn't that then close it and then make more room for it So e so what I would just say put it just leave it like this on charge with USB drive in overnight, and it should and it should just go like and it should work right, and if that doesn't work well then just follow the thing in the description. So yeah, there you go. That's how you fix it. Um, but yeah, it did take me a little while, and the link is for Windows Ten. This thing, the problem was described for Windows Ten, a setup, but um, 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 and and it say oh it's for Windows Ten, but try, but I think it might work for Windows Eleven too. I'm not quite sure, but just in case, do create a backup of it. If you really know how to want to know how to create a backup, first of all, figure out what OS you are using. If you're using Windows 7, like this thing was shipped with, then upgrade to Windows 10, right? Or just go in this, um, or you will have just a search about it online. I'm, I'm in a tight schedule. So yeah, there you guys go.